on India Today podcasts and you are in the sledging room Chennai Super Kings IPL champions for the fifth time MS Dhoni has equal Rohit Sharma's tally of yeah. five IPL titles yeah. so will he retire finally next year Yes, I mean, I don't think he would have also wanted. I mean, you guys, yeah. UCSK fans, hmm. wouldn't have wanted Thala to yeah. retire with one hmm. title less than yes. Rohit Sharma, or even Mumbai Indians, level terms your your Rohit your arch nemesis okay, yeah. in the IPL, or so, even on level terms with Rohit Sharma. Right? So, so that means that if next year he can he wins the title, he goes past Rohit Sharma and MI. He he will retire. You are and then whoa, maybe whoa, one more whoa, season. Whoa, whoa, we are jumping. Maybe the one gun. more we, season. We and are then we are jumping the we, gun. He'll finish with no, seven. No, no, come on, we are jumping. <laughs> hold on, guys. Hold Raj, on. but one thing, Raj, one thing. He predicted Lucknow Super Giants. Yeah, you yes. predicted RCB. I was the only one on this podcast who predicted Chennai Super Kings. You know, let's you know, ask our listeners to go skin, back. Thick skin. Thick yeah. having. Thick skin is very very important yeah. if you want to be Akshay Ramesh. Yeah. <laughs> Akshay, you turn Ramesh. What <laughs> the? Yeah. Shameless lying. Yeah. You shamelessly. Okay, let me give you credit for this. Thank you. You predicted Chennai Super Kings. Only one. And GT final. I also yeah. Yes. Yeah. And I had also predicted there will be no Dhoni retirement. Yes. The buzz will go on till the end of the tournament. Yes. And my fourth prediction is yeah. Dhoni retiring. Days before the 2024 IPL season okay. begins. That we have eight more months. He'll announce. For that. His, he'll announce. No, ten more months. Ten more that. months. Too. Yeah. And I'll tell you because you and you both both of you mentioned that he'll probably go back go out with six IPL titles. I'll tell you what will I what could happen. Dhoni will announce his retirement days before the 2024 IPL. Which huge buzz, play. huge buzz at the chip up. No, no, he will play, mm. but I doubt he'll play all the matches mm. because you have to take into consideration what he said mm. at the post match presentation ceremony, yeah, right? Yeah. Harshra Bhogle asked him about mm. his retirement plans, mm. and Dhoni said two or three things were very yeah. important. He said the easier thing would be for him to walk away right yes. now, having won that IPL title. Mm. It's going to be tough, but he wants to come back mm. for his fans and give them a parting gift. Yeah, he wants to work on his fitness, yeah. which he has for so yes. many years. Yes. Commendable, mm. commendable. He w- played the entire season with a dodgy knee. Mm. He was superb behind the wickets. Yeah. Um, Hit ten sixes. Didn't do much with the bat. Hundred and three runs or something. Yeah, I mean, golden duck in the final. Yeah. Uh, the moment he got the duck, a, a couple of us, you know, predicted I, that he's I, not going away. Now. I had predicted right through. I mean, yeah. that's, he, yes. he 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 wouldn't yeah. w- walk away like that, right? Yeah. Former England spinner Graham Swan joked about it. Yeah. You can't have a first golden, baller and yeah. then. Yeah. yeah. And if you're Amazon, you get to choose your exit, your retirement. Mm, yes. So why would you do that? So all of that has anyway has come into play, right? Mm. But phenomenal from the Gujarat Titans, yeah. yes. uh, champions in the debut season, mm. superb again, table toppers in consecutive seasons. That's uh, that's quite a feat. Yeah. But now comes the question. Now mm. comes the question that you'd only hear on the sledging room. Yes. yes. All right, Chennai Super Kings, phenomenal again. Mm. They were number two in the points table. Yeah. Um, they won the IPL fifth time. Ravindra Jadeja, heroics in that final over, ten yeah. runs of the last two balls. Devin Conway man of the match. Rudraj Gaik was splendid. Good spell from Deepak Chahar. Yeah. Uh, Jadeja. That stumping from Dhoni yes. to get rid of Shubman Gill. All said and done. Um, they also defeated the Titans in qualifier one to yes. get a direct entry into the final. Saurabh, I'll st- uh, Akshay, I'll start with you because mm. you are this CSK dude. <laughs> Where are some yellow there? Is that it like means. a subtle hint? <laughs> yeah. That's a subtle hint. He he realized it yes. would be it would be too obvious and too yes. blatant to wear his yellow jerseys um, <laughs> on the show. Yeah, on the show. Right? Okay, so we don't wear our hearts on our sleeves, right? But wear your heart on your sleeve yeah. now and tell me. Yeah, Chennai Super Kings. Mm. Fine. I, I'm scared to ask this question yeah, because yeah, you, you know, have to. You what have if to. I ever have no, to go no, down no. to Chennai after this? Raj, you have Did, always asked tough questions. Yes, you are in Delhi I, after. <laughs> Especially so much about the biggest Delhi cricketer Virat Kohli, but yeah, you go ahead and ask the question. So here's the question. Yeah. Um, fine. CSK mm. won the title, their fifth title. But yeah. were Gujarat Titans the more deserving winners? See, Gujarat Would, did Rain rob the Titans of a fair chance to win their? Second time. Raj, ifs and buts in sport, you can't see. At the end of the day, the winner is. No, the there is no ifs and buts. There was rain. Yeah, I, I, as I'm saying, if there was no rain, would they have won? You never know. You never know. If Mohit Sharma is getting hit by Ambati Raidu and Ravindra Jadeja, it was not Gujarat Titans Day. I am not. La- I am not doubting the lack. None of us can doubt the lack of effort from that team. But CSK won the match fair and square. And if you want to give them uh, credit for topping the table, topping the league table. 
then give them a, a super league like indian super league has the plate uh, shield indian super league okay, shield like shield. that give give them one shield you, for you know consolation you know prize what, you know what. and one more thing raj a lot of people said even the ipl rules and regulations says the, f- the team that finished on the top of the table should get the trophy if the match couldn't was wasn't happening no no but there's a lot of, there's a round about yeah, getting there they first wait for the match to happen exactly. doesn't happen then you got a two even five over shootout over, yeah. then there's a super over shootout yeah, even if, if super over. none of that is possible yeah then the table top even in that scenario i would say csk would have been robbed of the title because they defeated no, gujarat no. in the But qualifier 1 and then came to the final okay if you lose qualifier 1 <laughs> then you're not you know you, you, you can't get you, the title okay you were speaking like yeah. a true csk no, fan no i mean should respect yeah, that that's all yeah. right But i'm putting logic no, no, because you, you lost logic. the qualifier 1 no, no, you the, you say you the had Hilsen another chance to get to the final even if the no, match no. was completely rained out the title should have been there given to csk there has been a lot of oh there's been a Because come they on, lost no, the qualifier okay, one. On, no, you lose no, qualifier no, 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 one. No, you no, have no, no, another no. chance, and then you come to the final. There is. There is. How is that? They, they okay. earned that chance. Yeah, but, but that's table. fine. But you lost. You lost qualifier one. CSK would have gone that chance. Got that chance. Of course, but they didn't use that chance. See, the simple thing is. Yeah. yeah. Um, GT. Yes. Phenomenal in their first two seasons. Shubman <laughs> Gill, Orange Cap winner, Shami Purple Cap winner. I mean, imagine two guys from. Rashid and Mohit not far away. Rashid and Mohit not far away. Um. But by the way, there wasn't any other batter in that top ten, top fifteen yes, apart list from, apart from Shubman Gill. Shubman Gill, by the way, finished with eight hundred nineteen runs to win the Orange Cap. It's insane. What well, it's crazy numbers, right? But if you look at it, there were a lot of significant contributions from lot that of, batting. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm saying. But yeah. there were there, Abhinav Manohar. There was yes. Vijay Shankar, Sai Sudarshan. In fact, the second youngest uh, batter to score a fifteen in IPL final, the highest by an uncapped player. That ninety yes. six. Unfortunate to not to get a hundred. But sort of no ifs and buts. Yeah. Here are the bare facts. Mm. Gujarat Titans number one in 2022 IPL champions. Gujarat Titans number one in 2023 lost qualifier one, crushed Mumbai Indians. Mm, yes, right. The most successful side in the history of the IPL before Sunday Monday Tuesday. Tuesday. <laughs> Now, um, they get to the final 214 for four, which is the highest team total in a final. Then comes the rain. Then comes the DLS pass score. A lot of contention around DLS, hmm. right? But fifteen overs, one seventy one. The moment you start reducing those overs, somehow I think psychologically the batting team gets a little more impetus and says, yeah. you know what? It's not a twenty over game. Mm. You have to do this only for fifteen overs. Yes, yes. Even it was, I think they needed a, a little over ten runs an over to get to two hundred fifteen. A little over eleven per over to get to, uh, to one hundred seventy one and fifteen overs. I'm just saying, um, two hundred fourteen and one seventy one. There's a bit of difference there. Yeah, absolutely. There's a lot of difference there. But at the end of the day, you also have to chase down one seventy one to win the game. Yeah. I mean, Noor Ahmed was brilliant yesterday. We also uh, we also what happened. Everybody was getting hit, yeah. and then this guy comes, young spinner from Afghanistan. Yeah. He completely turned the game around. Then again, there was a partnership. And then Mohit Sharma comes in, he picks yeah. up two wickets, but you have to give credit to Javin Jadeja what yeah. he did in the last over. Hmm. Absolutely, you're right. Playing 20 overs game, playing 15 overs game, chasing down 214. The pressure of chasing down the highest total in IPL yes. finals. Exactly. No, I'll I'll add to you. I add to what you said. Just to play the devil's advocate, it's not just about 15 overs and 20. It's also about just three overs for Noor, exactly. three overs for Shami. Probably Shami would have bowled that final over. Yes. Yeah. Right. um josh little uh, i mean imagine 12 overs of pace from shami josh and mohit sharma yeah. imagine what happened in that game against mumbai indians obviously they were not down and out i mean even till the 10th over they mm. had hopes yes yes suddenly you have eight out of nine overs from from josh, Shum, uh, from josh little and Mo- mohit sharma that yes. completely changed Change the context the of the game Absolutely. mohit sharma came and removed surya kumar yadav On uh, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, early mo- hours of Tuesday, Mohit Sharma came and knocked over. Who did he knock over? Um, Ambati Raidu was it? Yeah, Ambati Raidu. He got and Dhoni. Ambati Raidu. And then so, he was on a hat trick. Ah, uh, he was on a hat trick. Um, I think teams should be know. allowed to be flexible with their number of bowlers in that scenario, right? No, I mean, couple much, them, no, a couple of them. No, a couple of them could be given the advantage to the bowling cap. At the end of the day, you're you're bowling fifteen overs, right? Whether a bowler bowls four overs or five, three overs should be the captain's choice. No, I do think no, that it no, becomes no, no, very no. difficult. It, it for is not the captain's choice to bowl more than four overs in a. No, not more than game. four overs, but four how, overs. 
Like if he wants, he can use a bowler for us. But that is giving undue advantage to the bowling captain anyway, right? Yeah. But I mean, would you doubt the idea of toss in these situations? Because MS Dhoni clearly said at the toss that he won the toss and he opted to bowl and he said, you know, I would have. I I'm bowling first just because no, there the is a possibility of the of game rain. give you the advantage. Then yes, that's fine. Exactly. You anyway have to toss it, right? Mm. Yeah, there's been talk around how uh, some. Captains, former captains said that look, when it's a visiting team, just give them the ch- decision. Mm, exactly. Let them make the decision yes, to bat yes. or bowl. Do away with the. Or toss. else the t- table toppers could have got the opportunity ah, to get yeah. call the call the toss. <laughs> but it is it was such an invigorating final. That's yeah. you know when the game started. But mm. frustrating wait. I mean, we got into the office on Sunday. <laughs> Obviously, we went home on you know, <laughs> in the early hours of Monday morning. We came back. Yeah. And after three hours, two hours, it looked like. <laughs> We didn't know. Yes. We didn't know. But we yeah. wanted a full match. Yes, yeah. we all wanted a full Nearly match. Nearly got there. Nearly got there. But nobody's complaining because of the cracker that is was. Yes. What would spare a thought for the fans? Absolutely. Who were in Ahmedabad. I mean, they were brilliant. This yeah. is the beauty of this game. Yeah. It's not just about cricketers, franchises mm. and teams. Mm. The fans make the game what the game is. Yeah. The way you saw they braved rain, they stayed yeah. there. We saw the visuals of fans sleeping on the illustrations just yeah. to catch a glimpse of Amazoni batting, yeah. which might have been his last IPL game. Might have been his. Might have been, which is not now. Thank yeah. and Amazoni has repaid it. You yes. you heard what he said after the match. So it, it is a, it is it is it is a beautiful game. This beautiful game is more about the relationship mm. between fans and the cricket heroes which they have seen grow. Mm. Yeah, creators like Amazoni. Yeah. So uh, absolutely, fans were brilliant and fans. If if it not if it, it it had not been for the fans, IPL would not have been this successful a league. Imagine if half of them turned by went back home, and the final. Where else? Where else in in the world will you see fans staying for three days, two yeah. days, braving rain, hmm. just to watch a match, yes. a cricket match? It's just a cricket match. Exactly also, the way Jayesha, uh, the board secretary, stressed in his tweet. Couple of times he tweeted, and both times there was mention of the gratitude for the fans. Mm. Even Dhoni said at the toss that you know they suffered more than us. For the players, it was just sitting in the dugout. It was not easy, of course. Yeah. The frustrating wait, going back to the uh, hotel rooms, and the table toppers getting an extra day off. But for the fans, you know they had to, you know, extend accommodation plans. And we had read reports which said the travel plans had changed, and then the travel prices had surged up. So all these things. You know what's most imp- impressive also is the way the ground staff really worked on the conditions. Yes. You know, a lot of people. I saw some really mean tweets. Exactly. But you have to understand what happens with heavy rain. Yeah. Accompanied by thunderstorm and pelting down for hours on end. Yeah. It happened on Sunday. Mm. By the way, when the rain briefly stopped and there was some hope of play starting on Sunday. Yeah. Harbhajan Singh, who was on air for the broadcasters, who was on yes, the ground, yes. he said the field was soup, completely bone dry, yeah. and that is commendable from the ground staff. The yeah. way they looked after the field, even after right, the uh, rain stopped closer to 11 p.m. on Sunday. Hmm. The umpire said they needed at least an hour to get yeah. the ground yes. ready for a five push the match over match. Day. But they moved. I think that was a wise decision yes, because you yes. know if it's an IPL final, the entire world is watching. You might as well get. As close to a full game as possible. So, and by the way, the forecast was better on Monday. Yes, it was. Uh, it rained around the time we had expected. Nine fifteen. Yes. PM. Nine fifty one. Nine fifty one. Something yeah. like that. Three yes. balls into the CSK innings. Yes. Yes. Over two hours to a nearly two hours and twenty minutes. Yeah. For the game to resume, and it was spectacular. Hmm. You wouldn't see players, uh, you know, slipping on the yes. field. Yes. You. Didn't at least didn't look like there was any particular difficulty for the bowlers to grip the ball. Um, the outfield was lightning quick. Yeah. The um, batters weren't hesitate in running those quick quick singles. I mean, CSK didn't have to run too many quick singles. They yes. mostly dealt in sixes <laughs> and boundaries, but commendable. So that's yeah. one thing of the, you know, charts that we need, should have spoken about because a lot of people it's very easy to it's jump easy. the gun and criticize. Yeah. But kudos to. Or uh, the Ahmedabad ground staff, but Akshay. Sometimes that kind of c- criticism, when you see it, it infuriates you. But yeah, the lack of understanding and all yes, that. Yes. I think it's lack of understanding. How can you put heavy rollers on the pitch? Even from cr- <laughs> from so-called journalists, I'm yeah. sorry to say this, but <laughs> it's it's funny. But again, 
Dhoni leadership. Okay, I, I know I asked you that question. Must have heard somewhere deep down. But <laughs> Dhoni's leadership to win the super to win this title mm. with a team that not a lot of people had a lot of hope from. Yeah. Okay. Tushar Deshpande. What's your bowling like? Tushar Deshpande. Mukesh Chaudhary from last year wasn't there. Mathisha Pathirana. Mahesh Thikshana. We started with Akash Singh. Deepak Chahar. You started with Akash Singh. And that batting lineup. Mm. Gaikwar Conway. Rahane. Nobody gave him a yes. chance. CSK pulled him into their side. Ambati Raidu, everybody thought he was a spent force. Mm. Ravindra Jadeja hasn't done a lot in T20. He's not really brought his test expertise into the T20 format. Mahendra Singh Dhoni, also a spent force with the bat. And yet you're going to win the IPL title in emphatic style. That's just insane. Only MS Dhoni could have done this. Could any other captain mm. have done this for the Super Kings with that team? I say this will become controversial, but no, Rohit no. nearly did it with Mumbai Indians. We have to give credit I think, to him. I think Rohit's ba batting line was super. Uh, super yes. batting Rohit line. had, in, if, yes, exactly. Mm. If you see Rohit's batting lineup, you had established India stars in that batting that lineup. Mm. Yeah. When, when you see CSK batting lineup, you see spent force batters. Mm. You see batters who have not proved themselves on international mm. Except Devon Conway and Moin Ali, I don't think a lot of them are playing international mm. regularly. T20 cricket. Ravind Jadeja has been injured in and out. Yeah. He has not been performing up to his level. Mm. So, I, if you ask me, I don't think anybody could have done that with this side. It was just the sheer magic of MS Dhoni. And but Rohit Sharma, by the way, yeah. and Mumbai Indians were helped along by Royal Challengers Bangalore. Yes. Had they he not lost that last point. game uh, of in, uh, at home to the Gujarat yeah. Titans, yeah. Uh, Mumbai Indians wouldn't have gone through. Yeah. CSK, on the other hand, didn't need any help. Suddenly you have become very anti-Mumbai Indians. I don't know why. I'm not anti-Mumbai Indians. I'm just trying to figure out facts. Why does it but always Raj, have to by be the way, <laughs> pro and against for you? By the way, yeah. we are all saying that it's Dhoni magic, the Dhoni miracle, the way he handles it, the Dhoni charisma and all that. But the way he spoke over the last few weeks, you know, suggests that there is a lot of hard work, you know. Of course. He says, he says you know, that coming back, preparing for an IPL, takes four months of my time. And he, first of all, he has to get back to shape. Like he's not playing competitive cricket. He has to work on himself. Mm. And then he has to work with the coaches, sit down with the coaches and pick, you know, he, they have they had picked players like uh, Shivam Dube and Ajinkya Rahane, mm. give them clear roles. Like Duane Bravo was hands-on with the bowlers. Like when Tushar Deshpande got those wickets, it was Duane Bravo who was more happy. When uh, Matisha Patirano got those wickets, it was Duane Bravo who was more happy. And this Eric Simons and uh, Duane Bravo getting into a good partnership and batting coach Mike Hussey, you know, a lot of them have credited Mike Hussey. For instance, Devon Conway has credited him, Michael uh, Ajinkya Rahane. So there's a lot of work that goes into, you know, making CSK, CSK. And it's just not, you know, Dhoni magic. Let's appreciate the teamwork that is there and headed by, heralded by, of course, the Dhoni uh, phenomenon. Is it also... Did MS Dhoni also show a lot of emotions throughout the tournament? Did he, did this overwhelm him? Obviously, he said he had tears in his eyes after mm. chance of Dhoni Dhoni in the opening match in Ahmedabad, which was the match against Gujarat Titans and CSK, mm. the first match of the 2023 IPL, many, many weeks back, almost two months ago. Uh, he said, he, he was, he, by the way, he was almost tear, yeah. crying when he lifted Ravindra Jadeja. Yes, he, yes, he couldn't could watch see. the action. He... His eyes Closed were closed his, yeah. for the final ball. Okay. And the fact that he came out to bat when he did. You mm -hmm. haven't seen him do a lot mm -hmm. of that. Not just in the final. He's done that several on several occasions. Yes. Is he also getting carried away? I mean, even MS Dhoni, mm -hmm. the iciest of Captain Cools, is he also getting carried away and getting overwhelmed with the entire euphoria around him for a change? And it's okay to say yes because Absolutely. he's human as well. You, you, you could hear what MS Dhoni himself said. Mm -hmm. At the end of the day, we all are human beings. Mm. He himself confessed, mm. yes, I am a human being. Mm. I also feel emotions. Yes, mm. he has not been showing those emotions for five, past yeah. 15, 16 years. Mm. But this year, since that first game, where he's, which he talked about, mm. fans chanting his name, he stood in the dugout, he, he felt that, he had tears in his eyes. Yeah. Yes, MS Dhoni was emotional. Throughout yeah. the tournament, you could see him. Like yesterday, like in the IPL final also, when he got out for zero, you could see he was miffed with himself. Exactly. You could see he wanted to do it for the team. <laughs> and when Jadeja yeah. scored those runs, yeah. holding Jadeja in, in that embrace, that emotional embrace, that says a lot about MS Dhoni, the emotional aspect of MS Dhoni. 
which has not been seen yeah. in last 15 16 years a lot even when he won world cup with india yes. a t20 world cup with india the champions trophy he he was number he took india to number one test rankings yeah. so this season and when he has realized that his his body is not up to the mark and this is the final phase of his career yeah. i think that is something where he is feeling yes now i should feel and embrace the love i have got from fans you know he he very well said that at the to- at the presentation ceremony that i realized when the chants when the when i teared up in ahmedabad that i should enjoy these moments and i should not take pressure mm. and he also said another thing at this stage of my career at the yes. very end of my career i want to you know embrace these emotions and all that mm. and have you ever seen him lift anyone or apart from yuvraj singh in that 2011 world cup final have you ever seen anyone i don't lift? think he has been that emotional ever since i mean i was there like i said at the 2011 yes, world yes. cup final i could see mm. Sachin, Dhoni, all these guys are not prone to showing a lot of emotions. Obviously, mm. that was the World Cup, yeah. right? World Cup final at home, you'd yeah. get that. Mm. But even when you saw Dhoni win the Champions Trophy, he mm. was cool. When yes. he won the 2011, 2007 T20 World Cup, mm. cool as a cucumber. 2013 Champions Trophy he was like jumping, and then yeah, I after. mean Dhoni wasn't. I mean yeah. Kohli was yeah. m- much more excited <laughs> he, as he always yeah. is. Few. Get the Kohli scale anywhere nearby. Yeah, it's not I mean, work. I mean, Kohli would be excited even yeah. after RCB beat Punjab in an IPL match. So, <laughs> but he was yeah. excited for Ravindra Jadeja as a champion, and uh, we'll Pistala. come to that as well. Yes, I mean, yes. we'll, we'll come to that because yeah. that is one question for both needs, of you. Huh. How much does you know CSK mean to Dhoni? As in, is he more animated for CSK to... than may, maybe for like? Say, no, I think for... with India, you know, a lot of people have asked that question, hmm. but I think with India, he. Also, because he's an India captain, he yes. had and remember that was many years ago, yeah. right? In, he gave the India captaincy two thousand seventeen, mm. so there was a certain poise around him. Yeah. Um, with CSK, it's just, you know, it's yeah. a city. Yeah. It's probably home to him after Ranchi. Mm. He spent probably more time in Chennai than he has in Ranchi over the last sixteen mm. years, given the fact that he's traveled mm. the world around, the, all around the world to play cricket. and you get overwhelmed i mean as an outsider when you're accepted mm. in a city like chennai it is overwhelming and yeah. i mean i can only imagine him walking down the team bus to get inside the stadium and the crowds chanting when he's in the steam bus as the bus approaches the yeah. ground uh, it would be overwhelming so i Do mean both of you feel that in delhi <laughs> have you been accepted enough <laughs> and if you ask me i have me, accepted delhi <laughs> <laughs> if you ask me yeah MS Dhoni when he became the captain of Indian team Indian cricket team stood was there for last 100 years mm. CSK started with yes. MS Dhoni yeah. Yeah. the inception of IPL mm. MS Dhoni was there yeah. he is the first captain of CSK yeah. he is the captain of CSK yeah. so CSK means MS Dhoni MS Dhoni means CSK in yeah. IPL yeah. when he was playing for Pune yes he played two seasons <coughs> but it was not that MS Dhoni when he comes back in that yellow jersey yeah. he is altogether a different person So Chennai loves Samir Dhoni. Yeah. Chennai loves their Thala, and Thala loves Chennai fans equally. And does Raj Thala Bain also loves Jadeja? Of course, of course. Because, because, because. I'll take you back to last year, 2022. Yeah. The captaincy was it almost thrust on Ravindra Jadeja. He made a mess of it. Yeah. CSK horror run. Hmm. I'm not But blaming the. But he was coming the, the, back the, from not, a long injury. Whatever. I mean, to, I mean, the facts are facts. Yeah. Yes, there was an injury layoff. Hmm. But CSK had their worst ever hmm. season. After 2020, yeah, but yeah, uh, Jadeja <laughs> couldn't take it anymore. Mm. Handed the captaincy back to Dhoni. Dhoni was far from impressed. Mm. He was pretty. A couple angry. of times he yeah, said yeah. I mean, he, the there was a very harsh post-match yeah, presentation. Yeah, I can't see. Yeah, so there was some very harsh words spoken. But you know, Ravindra After Jadeja apparent, also said, Raj. Yeah, I yeah. was informed during the mega auction itself exactly. that I would take up captaincy. Yeah, it was. But the it, official confirmation came, came days the before, day before two, the start of the one IPL. day before the start yes, of the IPL yes. last year. Um. There were reports of a maybe not a rift, but some sense of acrimony between mm. Jadeja and Dhoni. I remember. Uh, I think it was that game in Delhi when CSK qualified for the playoffs. Dhoni and Jadeja were seen in an animated conversation. A lot of people, mm. as it's common here, mm. they started linking that to another rift. We didn't see much into it because it could have been an animated discussion between a captain yes, yes. and his biggest even, match winner. Even in one of the matches, Ravindra Jadeja was talking animatedly to the CEO Kasi Vishwanath. Kasi, yeah. People spun yarns around it. Uh, exactly. I mean, yeah. that is uh, typical. Yeah. It happens with sections of the media here, yeah. but uh, there wasn't much to be read into it. Hmm. Uh, even if Jadeja and Dhoni have to fight, by the way, for all you reporters writing on it, talking about it, they, I think they'd probably do it in the. <laughs> 
um, you know, behind closed doors and yeah. not in the field with cameras glaring down yeah. at them. So don't read much into it. But I mean, for those people, it must have been like coming around a full circle yeah. when Dhoni lifted J.J. Yeah. Chah. What a, what a redemption story of sorts. It's the greatest love right? story in cricket. Of course. What a redemption. Raj, if you don't forget it, it was MS Dhoni who backed Ravindra Jadeja from the start. Like, he was a star before he got into Chennai Super Kings, but at the India level, yeah. Jaddu, Idhar Mad Dalna, Udhar Mad yeah. Dalna, that all started. And Jaddu was one of his, you know, primary wicket takers. Yes. Uh, yeah. he, he grew into a test bowler under MS Dhoni's yeah, captaincy. Absolutely. Right. He and grew as an all-rounder under course, MS Dhoni. He grew as a quality cricketer. Yeah. At that time, when he was not getting going, there were questions as to why he is getting so much backing. But now he is one of the best all-rounders, if not the best all-rounder in the world. Huh. So that story has, it's not just the IPL story. Yes. It's just yes. a day long, yeah. the story that dates long back that has given India a superb all-rounder. That is a big, that is a big one. But last year, okay, either there ho gaya. And Dhoni stepped in again. He could have easily said, no, I'm not going to take back the captaincy. Yeah. But I don't know how it happened. It, it, it whether just, Jadeja gave it back or... It just is, came through. Yeah, of course. Tell me, is this the is this a bigger bromance than uh, Rohit Kohli, Jadeja Dhoni? <laughs> if you ask me, hmm. the biggest romance of Indian cricket is Dhoni Kohli. That has to be no. the biggest romance for me. No, Who is Dhoni not Kohli Rohit? Yeah. No, not for me. Sorry. I love that Mahi Virat connection. <laughs> and yes, Jadeja yeah. and Dhoni, it's more of like. Uh, Guru Shishya. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Guru Shishya, Hardik will be, you know, hurt hearing mm. this. Yes. Because oh, it was a leading question. <laughs> yes. Hardik. Coming to Hardik Pandya, I mean, yeah. what did he say after the final? He said, if I had to lose to someone, mm. it would rather be MS Dhoni and yeah. the Chennai Super Kings. Mm. Good things happen to good people. I mean, yeah. I've never seen a losing captain, yeah. by the way, so graceful. Even their, even their franchise, entire franchise, the, twi the tweet that they put yeah. out after the year, a child is within us. Read out the tweet. But it's commendable. Hardik mm -hmm. Pandya, the way he uh, has shaped into a captain. Yeah. I, I, just, I don't know. I think he's a cooler captain than Captain Cool MSD. Yes, I think. The way he reacts under pressure. Yes, right? Hardik Pandya is expressive. Mm. But he expresses himself... Like he's enjoying every moment, hmm. winning or losing. MS Dhoni comes and says, a lot of people come and say, winning and losing are part of the game. But when Hardik Pandya is talking, when he's playing the game, like in the IPL final, when Mohit Sharma got hit for the boundary, you could see him coming and embracing yes. Mohit Sharma, yes. giving him... The yeah, first yes. thing he did was yes. that. Yeah. So that is a basic quality of a very good leader. Hmm. And hmm. being this captain cool leadership, hmm. that has to be something which he has learned from MS Dhoni, hmm. but he's proving to be... Mm. Someone who is much more cooler. And you know, when on him, there, was a, there yeah. was a clip of mm. Hardik Pandya doing the rounds mm. uh, from that game on the final. Mm. When CSK needed 10 runs mm. of the last two balls, everybody said Hardik Pandya was celebrating too early. Mm. Now, you know, he was kind of animated. He's always animated these yes. days. Mm. But I don't think he was celebrating. I think he was just enjoying that yeah. moment. Yes. He's like, okay, you know what, 10 runs, let's see. And Anybody when you, when the bowler sees the captain like that, yeah. he wouldn't feel tensed, right? Yes. If, if you're looking tensed, if you you are looking tensed, I, Mohit Sharma is an experienced bowler. Had it been a young Yash Dayal, how would he have he have felt? So, you know... So it's the this, same when you look at Rohit Sharma. I'm not going there. Why? No. <laughs> Why Rohit not? Sharma, yeah. if you ask me, I'll be straight to the point. Hmm. Rohit Sharma... In India jersey mm. has been absolutely disappointing as a captain. Even at his Mumbai Indians captain this season, mm. he's looked he very. Been, why won't you go there? No, nah, but some, for someone like much. Akash Madhwal, for someone like Akash Madhwal, he put his hand around him when he so, was hit in the. Rohit Sharma is a captain who will yeah. come and celebrate when you take yeah. wickets, but he will shout at you yeah. and shout in the field. Let Hardik Pandya win even five. Get to even five titles. No, no, I'm just, no, Let's no, not discredit not, someone who has. No, no, we are not discrediting. Yeah. We are talking yeah. what has happened yeah. in hard, field. hard questions. Yeah. yeah hard, I mean, you yeah. shy away from these hard questions. Yeah. I don't know what. No, but I have been very impressed by what Mumbai Indians have done this season. Regardless, no, no, we'll, come, we'll come to Mumbai Indians. Yeah. Why? I, yeah. You know, you don't have to put a disclaimer if you're yeah. asking questions <laughs> of a cricketer. We have to come to and discuss what Mumbai Indians. Why we've mm. discussed that, by the way. Yeah. Why you? Why are you so? You know. But are we hyping up Hardik Pandya? So I think early? I think he's earned the right. Yeah. You. How many captains have done that with mm. such flair in their first two seasons? Yeah. It's Raj, just. Yeah. You know, crazy, crazy good. And Ashish Nehra, what a legend Nehra ji is. Of course, of course. He keeps Nehra. it simple. Yeah. You know what I like the best about these two? Throughout Sunday and Monday, they kept a cool head. Yes. 
Yes. Uh, I think uh, some of the commentators even pointed that out that yeah. they're both very lively guys. Yes. They like to joke around, but when yes. they were on the field, yeah. serious. Even no during joking. those rain breaks, Ashupa and Jadeja yes. were having fun. Yeah. yeah, but when it came to discussions <laughs> with the umpires, the match yeah. referee, yeah. Uh, both Hardik and Nehraji were very very yeah. focused. Had that poker face. Exactly. On. And all and these guys, Raj. Yeah. yeah. Ms. Yeah. Hardik, Ashish, I Rohit. I really saw MS on the field, by the no, way. No, I'm saying not the field. <laughs> Har- MS, Hardik, Rohit yeah. and uh, Ashish. Yeah. They all look like, you know, they, they are just calm, collect, collected, composed on the field. But the work that they do off mm. it, no? And by the way, ha- Nehra sits with a pen and paper yes. and he gets the job done. Maybe I don't know how much of data and analytics he listens to. Yeah. But the way he has, you know, groomed this young side, you know, Hardik himself said, that Ashish called Hardik even before the franchise was owned, franchise was bought, saying that we have this proposition, Will would you like to come and lead the team? Hmm. So he was that clear that he wanted Hardik Pandya. He saw the leader in Hardik Pandya when no one else saw it. Right? Yeah. He had never led any team before that. And then uh, app- appointing him, especially after an injury, injury spell, uh, Hardik was not even a first yes. choice member in the Indian team at yes. that time. Uh, but in one and a half years, we have completely forgotten that phase of Hardik. Yes. Now we are talking, we are equating him to the likes of MS Dhoni and Rohit Sharma in the IPL. And he no, no, is... No, we don't, I, I am not. No, I am not. I am just saying that he is the beginning of, course, of a new era of Indian of leadership course, in cricket. Course. It's not wrong to come yeah. get these comparisons also because... No, no, I think those comparisons are a little too misplaced sometimes when you yeah. start comparing Shubman Gill to Virat Kohli. Yes. I mean, he also needs to go out and have some... <laughs> yes. Uh, of those series that Virat Kohli did in England in 2018 or yeah. Australia in 2014-15. So, I think sometimes comparisons are fine, but, you know, you have to be a little... And yes, when you're talking about Hardik mm. Pandey, Ashish Nehra, yeah. please don't forget Gary Kirsten. Yes, of course. The yes. World Cup winning coach. Yes. And by the way, do you guys remember, Ashish Nehra and Gary Kirsten were at RCB in 2019. Yes. And they were yes. sacked. Yes. They were sacked. And <laughs> Even then, there, Ashish Nehra used to direct the field yes, from yes, the, yes. outside the boundary road. Yeah. This and thing who happened, was the captain back then? Virat Kohli. Yes. This thing happened in 2019. Yeah. Three years later, yes. a new franchise is formed. Yeah. These two come, yeah. they win the title. Virat Kohli is still IP. Yes. He has not won a yes. title trophy. Virat Kohli was very quick to congratulate Jodeja mm. and MS Dhoni. But, I mean, let's not be mean. Yeah. It's okay. Of course. They're friends. Yes. And like you said, the Dhoni Kohli yeah. story is the biggest romance in Indian cricket. Probably in world cricket. Yeah. Uh, Kohli and Jadeja go back a long way. <sighs> I mean, you feel bad for Virat Kohli, 639 runs, <laughs> back to back 100. <laughs> you know, <laughs> when we were discussing, when Saurav was saying Dhoni is M, CSK, CSK is Dhoni, uh, Virat has played for RCB no, from 2008 <laughs> all his life. Yes, he's the and he has pledged his alliance also can saying he that. Can ever win an IPL title with RCB? I hope, or can I hope RCB win an, ti- win an IPL title with Kohli? Oh, that is is that a question or a question yeah, yeah. I hope that happens hmm. how is that going to happen yeah how is that going to happen because you focused on Kohli hmm. you were focused on Kohli Gale De Villiers for years hmm. now you're focused on Kohli Maxwell and, and Duplessis hmm. you don't have any other batter up top down the order your bowling lineup hinges around Mohammad Siraj yeah sometimes around Harshal Patel or maybe the odd spell from one in the Hasaranga, there is nobody else. Mm. And even if they get good bowlers, they're not getting backing. That's something that is maybe maybe they should try giving the team management to the fans. They will spin some. <laughs> they magic. wanted that, right? They yeah. want it. And I hope th- this happens. <laughs> if RCB has to win an IPL yeah. title, because this team management, sixteen seasons, yeah. three finals, still no title. Yeah. This is the impact of Virat Kohli. On a day when the Chennai Super Kings have won their fifth IPL title, <laughs> on a day when the Gujarat Titans played remarkably, heroically well to almost defend their IPL title, yeah. we are asking whether Virat Kohli can win an IPL title. Let's get to better. So, Virat, answer. if you're listening to our podcast, this is yeah. doffing a hat to you. The impact that you have on Indian cricket. Raj, you wanted me to read that tweet. You know, that tweet was beautiful. The Gujarat from Titans Gujarat tweet, Titans. by the way. To I don't know, what Chennai is Wala? Super. Wala, what is Wala? Okay. Is that a local slang? Maybe that's a Gujarati yeah. uh, way of greeting. Yeah. Wala thala. Okay. We knew we'd have, uh, we'd have to battle against not just your genius, but the sea of yellow in this fairy tale final. While we are disappointed tonight that this child within us is happy as ever to witness you hold up that trophy. Imagine a setup where even the Gujarat Titans team were cheering on MS Dhoni when he went to yes. pick no, the right. More than that, Could have imagine. Happened. imagine a big league final anywhere else in the world, a losing team posting like this for a winning team. I can't. I, I, I have I, not seen it. I have not seen it. 
Liverpool versus Man United. <laughs> they are not going to post. Hasn't they? Are, they are Man be City versus Man City versus Man United Premier League Imagine final. Imagine Barcelona Real Madrid. No, oh, that's not going to happen. But you know they are becoming a likable franchise, right? It's just their second season, Raj. We shouldn't forget that. They've achieved so much. They've unearthed talents. That's the more most important. The most likable franchise now would be Delhi Capitals. They won the Fair Play Award. <laughs> Yeah. That is what they have done this season. Being a DC fan, yes. I'm happy at least we won something. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, fair play. Yeah, yeah. you can't win the trophy with that team, with yeah. the bad management. So, at least you won something. Yeah. Has Virat Kohli's RCB ever won fair play award? I don't know. <laughs> so, <laughs> at least Dhoni was candid enough to admit that huh? with Raidu in the team, we would have never won the fair play award. Best because Instagram he said story like award me. can be given to RCB. <laughs> Raj, but tell me something. Are GT becoming the most likable franchise? I right? think so. Yeah, I they think have so. become. Yeah. I mean, imagine Gujarat Titans mm. garnering. I mean, Chennai Super Kings by far the most popular IPL team. I think Gujarat Titans are no, getting RCB, there very soon. RCB are right up there. Popular in terms of popularity. <laughs> in Bangalore, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, imagine Hardik Pandya. Mm. The way he expresses himself on the field and he walks the talk. You yes. know, it's very easy yes. for a captain to say, you know, what winning and losing is not important. Exactly. But yeah. even when he loses, there's a smile on his face. Yeah. Nehraji has a smile on his face. Kirsten is pretty chilled and laid back. So I think I think that's what fans like to see. Hardik doesn't go out and you know admonish his bowlers. Exactly. Like a certain captain who gets irritated when the DRS doesn't go the way he thought mm. it would, even yes. when he's relying on his bowlers. Yeah. To, you know, yeah. deploy him. So, I think I think Gujarat Titans are headed in the right way. The kind of talents that they've unearthed already. Yeah, I mean they have been. They have not used Rahul Tewatia well, but that's yes. no that's this season. But yeah. also because Tewatia hasn't been in the best of yes. nick, yes. and maybe they weren't very confident about his bowling because a lot of times what happens is you see a bowler in the nets. Rule also. And you see a bowler in the nets yeah. and you realize that you know what he's not mm. quite there. So let me not. And Tewatia, Rashid, and Miller, their roles are very well defined lower yeah. down the order. Yes. And and that clarity is very important for yes. some yeah. for, for for people to not get frustrated. CSK and have that been doing. That is what CSK it. have done, and that is what GT is yes. is yes. doing. MI also have done it. Like yes. MI that. also exactly. have done. And you know, it's the lack of runs from David Mill and Rahul Tewatia yeah. that also prompted uh, GT to send Sai Sudarshan up. Yes, and Rashid and Khan. Khan. No, Rashid Khan has been in good form. I mean, yeah. he's, he could have hit a few, but Hardik Pandya has to really he has borne the brunt of yes. the hard hitting impact because. Yeah. And he has not. He, there were criticisms about his own form, Raj. Yeah. As in, and he has been selfless. He has been selfless. He could have easily promoted him to number three on the final day, and he could have done. Tried to be a hero. Yeah. Yes. But, but that's what I like about both the Pandya brothers, by yes, the way. Even yes. Krunal admitted that it was yes. he should have done better. Yeah. After the eliminator, he yeah. took the blame on himself. Uh, Hardik had done that after a ge- defeat to DC. Hmm. Imagine Gujarat Titans lo- losing to DC. Yeah. As a DC fan, you should probably, you know, <laughs> yeah. get that. Yeah. Um, that is one achievement we had this yeah. year. I think yeah. that was your biggest achievement. That was the only achievement. We Before had you won the fair play yes. award. <laughs> yeah. So, but fair play, fair play. To but Prithvi Shaw 50, the, the end of the season, sparking hopes again. I don't know. I don't know. Even if Prithvi, I mean, it has to be seen whether Prithvi Shaw is with Delhi next year. <laughs> <laughs> yes. This is going to be a complete yeah. revamp, I hope. I hope. But before we go, since it's the season mm. finale and obviously next week on, we'll start looking into the World Test Championship yes. final. And let us not get carried away with the IPL because yes. the World Test Championship is going to be a different mm. uh, cup of kettle of tea altogether. <laughs> yeah. England, moving ball, Australia, deadly paces, Nathan Lyon and uh, a very, very good test batting lineup. Yeah. And, and our and team is just, um, all our players have played just IPL except Pujara who has been Red in Ball, England. Yeah. Red Bull Cricket in county. Yeah. But don't forget a charged up Virat Kohli. It's not won the IPL and seen the euphoria around winning teams. So, uh, they, haven't there been tournaments before where Virat Kohli went into a tournament after not winning the IPL? <laughs> He's done that for 16 years. <laughs> you know, so what's yeah. that logic? Watch. Why can't you watch out for a charged up Shubman Gill ready to deliver after an I, I am just season. waiting for that by the way Rohit Sharma has been our test, best test batter if yes. Rishabh Mantis is not there yes. yes so a lot depends Hundred on his you know, you know, you know, fans got what they wanted this year, this year IPL MS Dhoni winning the title WTC Rohit World Cup Kohli inspired Rohit fingers crossed Whoever, whoever gets runs for India, I'm World Cup. With. Even if it's another magical couple of 50s from Shardul Thakur, yes. yeah. some gutsy batting from, let's say, Ravindra Jadeja. Yeah. I'm happy with that. Yeah. As long as India end up winning the World Test Championship final. Before we go, Raj, 
both of you can you tell me one player that impressed you most and one player that didn't live up to your expe- expectation i think yashashwi jaiswal one mm. player that impressed me most and the one player that didn't quite live up to my expectation was i think a bowler because i expected a lot more from him around this game i'll tell you why deepak chah hmm he bowled picked some crucial wickets even on the final he picked the crucial wickets but in a in a bowling lineup yeah. where you are the senior most pro operating around tushar desh pande matisha pathirana akash singh hmm. before that entire uh, yeah. injury spate picked up i think chahar should now be really spearheading that csk bowling lineup he did yeah. pick wickets he was pretty impressive in patches but i don't you know the reason i'm disappointed with him was because i don't think he was entirely the leader of the bowling pack and he needs to be the leader of this bowling pack current bowling pack for the super kings for me it was rinku singh okay that the man impressed me the most mm-hmm. everybody impressed everybody i think what he did for kkr he turned the season for them yeah. whatever i think five or six wins at least four of them would have yeah. come because of his batting hmm. against csk against gt that sco- hmm. uh, that 30 runs against yash dayal hmm. he impressed me the most yeah. if you ask me about one player who did not impress me I will talk about entire DC team. <laughs> I have a DC, DC fan. I will talk about David Warner, Ricky yeah. Ponting. I will talk about Prithvi Shaw, Sarfraz yeah. Khan. Hmm. Everyone, each other. And ignore Kya. I was yeah. expecting much more of that bowler. Yeah. It was just not there. Absolutely horrendous season for us. Yeah. So I hope next season is a different one. So one, one player that impressed me the most is Mohit Sharma. You know, despite that last yes. over, last two balls, he won it. He nearly won it for GT. and to have not been sold in the auction for the last 2 years and to have been a net bowler he broke that you know that uh, that sense of you know inferiority around being a net bowler and then he has performed 27 wickets in the season i won't be surprised if he gets a t20 call up again with all that ah, yeah, he has been doing yes, and one player or one team that has not that has not lived up to my expectation is one player is rahul tripathi to get and to that you know uh, india team is as are <laughs> he was you know i don't know whether he has ruined his india chances by having you know a, such a poor ipl mm. for the sunrisers let's see could be could be but we'll also ask our listeners and our yes. viewers too and i i, I yeah. like to point one more thing yeah. you talk about srs i wanted to see more of umran malik this season yes, yes, we did not yes. see more of him even iron markram didn't know where he was <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. Know why he was out so of the that was quite disappointing yes, as an ingrid yes. fan seeing that and not just for us even for the captain i yes. can sure tear away fast bowler <laughs> just not playing exactly even markram would be wondering where was umran <laughs> i mean kane had him last these year. are india prospects Raj. yes Imagine. rahul tripathi and umran malik even ashdeep singh the way he was yeah. used yeah um uh, i was not very impressed I mean, you need to be a little more careful yeah. around India pacers, up and coming India yes. pacers. Look at the way CSK used to shard Deshpande. In fact, I spoke to Irfan Pathan uh, for an interview f- last week, and mm. he pointed this out exactly. And mm. I was talking to him about Dhoni's legacy, and he said the exact same thing. He said, "Look at the way Dhoni has used to shard Deshpande. Look at his economy rate, but he's still giving him those chances. He ended up with what twenty-one wickets. Yeah. yeah. So he was expensive. Yeah." yeah. I think he gave away almost as many runs as Rutraj Rai was scored. Five sixty four runs to be precise. Yeah, but I think Rai was scored a little more than five sixty four. Yeah. Uh, but that's the magic of Amazon. Imagine the way he nurtured Matisha Patirana. Yeah. Akash before I that. I think Mukesh uh, before in the year before. Yeah. In his mind, he said he had said he has seen Tusha Desh Pandey as a leg spinner. You get me wickets. <laughs> <laughs> I don't care if you give <laughs> runs. He doesn't care. That's the magic of Amazon. And if all for our listeners. If you want to reach out to us, if you want to comment on the biggest moments yes. in 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 the 2023 IPL, yeah, you can always write to us at email and uh, email us at pods at indiatoday.com and ping us on eight five double eight nine double six double nine six and let us know what you thought yeah. were the highlights of the 2023 IPL for you. Did the Gujarat Titans deserve to win it? Yes. Did the Mumbai Indians miss out because of yeah. a you know more penetrative bowling lineup? Who knows how they would have fared? um and but whether rcb will ever win a title will rcb win an ipl title yeah please be, i mean yes the floor <laughs> is open to that i mean that's an agenda that akshay keeps pushing, pushing and he will take this into the new uh and the next edition of the ipl as well but our focus will move to the world test championship Champion final finals, next week course. when we celebrate the first anniversary of the sledging room yes. so that's something that We're pretty excited about and pretty kicked up about. But if you're also listening to us on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Google Podcasts, wherever it is, 
please rate us, drop your comments. And yes, you can always watch us on YouTube now that we're on camera for the last seven, eight months. Do stick on to us. The sledging room is only going to get more hostile and more interesting. Thank you yes. so much. Have a great week ahead. And all Chennai Super Kings fan, congratulations. Thala has done it for you again. Sweet mangoes for the CSK. <laughs> <laughs>